Today I want to focus on a painting that I made during a live stream on YouTube in January 2021. In my eyes, Posterized uh, Stimulation 2 that you see here is a portrait painting that uh, combines abstract and figurative uh, forms. This painting is available for uh, purchase on my gallery website um, in 2021 painting section or it can be directly uh, accessed uh, via uh, a link that I post uh, here on the YouTube channel. The Posterized Stimulation series is a series of uh, new paintings that explore different shades of uh, green as well as uh, the perception of color in the paintings. The primary effects of the color green on our body are widely known and used in advertising, psychology and uh, in our approaches to nature. Green colors are calming, stress relieving and generally have favorable effects upon our bodies. These uh, paintings combine blurred elements, patterns and soft lines through dedicated mark making and pure interpretations of elements that intensify the perception of uh, green in our bodies. Some of uh, this uh, could uh, be calming and uh, carry the vibration of uh, growth whilst some might bring an uneasiness that leads to the, the viewer to browse around the painting searching for unwinding significances. Every painting made, made with uh, tones of uh, green is unique and uh, different. This uh, fact sets this uh, oil paintings apart from other series of artworks that I have uh, painted. When I was about 80, 80 years old, uh, Polaroid cameras were at the peak of their popularity and then suddenly disappeared. I experienced them for a short time. Uh, this form of photography was uh, unique because it gave a false impression of reality and its uh, color tones. The pictures appeared to be much older than uh, what they were actually capturing. When I began uh, painting Posterize Stimulation 2, I was inspired by this type of uh, photography. My goal was not to paint what one could depict in a photo, but rather base the painting upon the impression of what I saw in the picture. In my eyes, the green color that I used helped me to achieve this notion. To be considered uh, posterized, a uh, photograph or image, picture, etc. must uh, use only a small quality of various colors and tones. Posterization of a uh, meme image entails a continuous gradation of few to several areas of fewer tones with sudden changes from one color to another. This was initially done with photographic methods in order to create posters for advertising. Creators can now do this uh, photographically or with a digital image uh, editing in Photoshop or other sources. Posterization may be intentional or an unintended artifact produced by value uh, quantization. The painting Pastoral Stimulation 2 was created during a live stream on my YouTube channel. For this uh, painting I decided to focus on uh, green uh, tones and uh, patterns. This uh, portrait was uh, painted in a single session which uh, helps understand the process behind making uh, this uh, piece.
Throughout the history of uh, art, eyes were a vital aspect of uh, both portraiture and uh, person in the painting. The, we recognize each other through our eyes and are able to connect on a metaphysical level, whether in real time or through art. Um, through our eyes, we can sympathize and observe. Oftentimes, an art piece that depicts eyes will catch our attention first. Eyes, in paintings, are the element through which we create a psychological portrait of the person. We can fabricate stories and connect or disconnect uh, on an emotional level just from seeing the eyes. They can uh, give the impression of uh, clairvoyance, uh, which is uh, alleged intelligence that enables one to obtain information about an object, personality, location, or psychological appearance through perception. The eyes uh, can also portray the concept of uh, omniscience, which uh, the potential to understand, which is potential to understand all of the things around us. In uh, monotheistic religions, this is a property exclusive to God. In other religions, omniscience is a characteristic that any person can ultimately achieve. Other characteristics uh, that eyes are commonly linked with uh, are intelligence, knowledge, diligence, having pure morals and uh, truthlessness. Looking into another person's eyes could be a sign of honesty and uh, trustworthiness. Eyes often symbolize wisdom and uh, power. When there is a lack of eyes in uh, the painting, then we look for a substitute vocal point that gives us an impression of uh, what the eye could have said to us. The face depicted in the painting posterized uh, stimulation uh, here does not have eyes. The head is uh, uh, included but only um, in a three-quarter view and it is uh, blurred and integrated with uh, the background. Most of the space in uh, Pasteurized uh, Stimulation uh, 2 is occupied by loosely depicted uh, pattern. The pattern uh, in this uh, painting presents a sense of uh, order in what might otherwise appear chaotic. The viewer has a chance to understand uh, and identify recurring ornaments that allow observers to make knowledgeable guesses, opinions and create systems and conditions about the person in the portraiture painting. It is a way to find uh, logic that otherwise would have been created by the depiction of eyes. Patterns create regularity in a painting. They allow us to recognize designs that uh, we are familiar with. Through this, we are able to connect with the depicted person. We can create a sense of stability and establish a connection through that which we imagine um, we saw we, what we saw in the eyes. Painting of the day is a series of uh, posts and videos about my artworks. It is uh, one of the ways I can connect my paintings to viewers like yourself. Every Monday um, you can check my website or my YouTube for a new video or post that is a reflection on one of my paintings. As of uh, today, Pasteurized uh, Simulation Stimulation 2 is available to purchase on my gallery website. It can be found directly under the link uh, in the description. Uh, if you would like uh, me to write a blog post or video about a particular painting you like, please send me an email or message and uh, let me know. Per your request, I will write uh, about the concept story 
and meaning behind it for painting of the day series that I do on YouTube and my website. Feel free to check out my previous uh, videos and posts. I posted a new blog post about 10 starts from one as well as a video, which is a piece that I painted in 2017 after my fellowship residency in, at Fundazione Palarte in Rome, Italy. This uh, painting is uh, in a private collection and it is one of my favorite uh, pieces. You might also be interested in uh, um, viewing a video about uh, my portrait painting I don't know what to call you free uh, which I made uh, a video about last week and actually got sold. And uh, that would be it uh, for uh, today. This will complete uh, this uh, video. I also created a blog post uh, with images uh, about uh, painting that I'm talking about right now. You can uh, check it on my website. I hope you find this uh, series of uh, painting of the day interesting. Every Monday you can check for a new video. Uh, I find it very interesting for the reasons that I already mentioned. So I'll see you in the next one and please uh, like and subscribe and share this uh, video with anyone who might be interested in this uh, content. So thanks again and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.